This is Talk About Topeka on Gab Local TV and TV25. This episode brought to you by Field of Greens and The Break Room. And here's your host, Chris Schultz. So we're really, really excited about something that's coming up. We have this uh, partnership that we've been working with our friends over at 712 Innovations. There's some really great people over there, make some great content, got some good people uh, at the 712 Innovations group, and they have an event coming up that's new. It's similar to the One Million Cups concept. They're calling it Fast Pitch. And uh, April 13th, uh, I get to be one of the speakers at their, their Fast Pitch event. And so what that's gonna be is six minutes of us pitching what Gab Local TV is to a bunch of people who are you know local entrepreneurs, uh, from financers, people who make content, all that kind of stuff, all the people who might be interested in what we're doing. They'll learn a little bit about that in a six minute, minute presentation, then we'll sit around and talk about it. And there's two of us that will be going uh, through that. So it's pretty exciting, Frank. Are you ready for that? Oh, I'm ready. Yeah, this this is exciting. I really love 712 Innovations. It's it's a very cool uh, you know organization, and I want to show people a video that we put together because people ask a lot of questions about what is this Gab Local TV thing? What are you guys doing with that? Um, so one of the pieces that we have uh, is a a promotional video. It's on our website, so you can check that out at any time. We're going to show it here for people today. But it, is, it does, it explains what we're trying to do here with Gab Local as a television network of local content produced by the people, for the people, uh, making it really affordable for uh, local businesses and local charities to get the message out there. You know, there's, there's never a cost to any of those folks because we have really generous sponsors who are coming together to help us put this show out there. Um, so check it out. This is gablocal.tv. It's coming to you right here on TV25. So are you as excited as I am about this, Frank? Because this is so cool uh, that we've been able to work with some great people to put all of this together and move things forward for our community. I'm, I'm so excited about what the future holds for us with this. And I'm a little bit nervous about this fast pitch event because there's so much to talk about and we got to get it out there in six minutes. So uh, it, it's pretty cool. Like, I don't know, how can we do that, Frank? Oh, I, I'm sure you can handle it. Do I need to be there with my time clock and saying, all right, no, no, you're <laughs> no, maybe you should. Off. 
Maybe yeah. you should. Anyway, uh, no, they, they will actually be recording the pieces there. Uh, some of our friends who are content providers there, and we're going to get that footage and we'll put it on the show. So you'll get to see what that was and how it all went down. So that's going to be really, really cool. Um, but yeah, I've, I, I'm excited about what we're doing here with Gab Local. I'm excited of the opportunities that it opens up uh, for the communication between Topeka, Lawrence, and Kansas City, the, the levels of communication that have not currently existed, and the opportunity to make really good quality content that talks to the people who are doing things, and the people who are making progress, and the people who are trying to live their dreams, um, and the people who are trying to help people live their dreams, and the people who are helping people down on their luck. That's what we're trying to do. We have to talk about this stuff. If we don't talk about it, then nobody knows what's going on. Like, we got to make sure that we keep that word out there. So uh, that's, that's what's really exciting about all this, to be able to take what cool people here are doing and get that message over to Kansas City and what cool people in Kansas City are doing and get that message back here so that we can become one big unified community as opposed to you know three individual ones here in Northeast Kansas. So. Okay, never mind that. I want to get my hands on that vinyl cutting machine because <laughs> I just want to play. I've never done one of those before. You know, I'm a techie geek and I love technology that I have never had. And they've got a vinyl cutter, like a big roll of vinyl and it cuts the vinyl and it makes the applique's letters and, and cuts stuff. Letters. Okay. Yeah, it's I. So, so I know that's one of the one of the we'll call it toys over at Seven Twelve Innovations because they have some incredible <laughs> machinery over there that you can get checked out on and, and work on. So Seven Twelve Innovations, check that out. Very very cool. Um, on today's show, we've got a really great show for people. We're going to be taking a tour of the Capitol building. We actually did this a while back. We're going to be bringing it back um, with Jim Renner. Jim Renner was the project manager for the construction for JE Dunn Construction at the time. Um, and now he's working on some of the, or currently working on some of those pocket parks on Kansas Avenue that are coming in. So it's very, very exciting that, uh, that he was able to give us this tour back then and he's still very involved with downtown and, uh, and a, an incredible volunteer here in the community. A good friend, good guy. Uh, so stick around. All that's coming up after a quick break here on TV 25. Brought to you by Field of Greens and The Break Room because TV 25 cares.